Today I'm going to be playing some survival hunter, probably one of my few favorite specs in this game. And uh, here's the build, and you guys know the drill, we got the worst map, yada yada yada. <laughs> Without further ado, let's go ahead and get this started. Hopefully we have enough teammates going to waterworks, we got a few people left behind. Um, slow them down, of course they take the side, yep. That would have been amazing though if we actually slowed them down long enough to get waterworks. I don't think anybody would have gotten there fast enough to actually care though. Alright. Here we go. Going for some big damage. On the priest healer. Stunning him. Pain deathing. There's the uh Cocoon from the Mistreaver. I'll drop a steel chop there because I know somebody's gonna walk into it and then hopefully they'll just get away from the healer or something, I don't know. Or maybe not. Alright, we'll just drop a tar chop over there. If we could just get one person on this mistreaver, we could easily get a kill on him. Um Seriously? It didn't get it. Oh, apparently uh, the freezing trap uh, didn't work on him. That's unfortunate. I really don't understand the water trap physics, I guess. Alright, we'll just have to kill this mystery right now, apparently. I was going a little bit easy on him. But we're just now going to have to do it. There we go. Perfect's done. Yada yada. He's dead. Their hunter is definitely their best geared person on their team. The Mist Reaver is about... He's not super undergeared, but he's definitely not geared either. So... The Priest is definitely more geared than him. The Guard Android is apparently DC'd. Whenever you see somebody that's grayed out, like yeah, the person I'm targeting, it means they're DC'd. Alright. Um... Yeah, we should be able to save Lighthouse. The Feral Druid should be fine. Actually, that's not even a Feral. It's a Rest Druid. He's... No, he he's actually is Feral. Alright, good to know. So many warriors in this game, man. So many warriors in this expansion. And if they all stack like that, they just make it easier kills for us. <laughs> like, look at that. My team just immediately destroyed everything. Did you not learn your lesson, uh, Mr. Fear? Perfect. Pierce, he did not learn his lesson. I really wanted to get a kill on that red. I probably should have went and slowed him down, but he might only enhance the healer. And I definitely don't want a healer to get land enhanced. Also, two of them AFK, I don't know who did. Because my add-on hasn't updated yet. Yeah, this is not looking good. Nope, maybe maybe it is. I might be fine. For a sacrifice. I don't think it clearly matters. Or at least sometimes it doesn't feel that way. I mean, Roar Sacrifice definitely helps, but... Warriors just hit like freight trains, man. Now they have three AFKers. Yeah, Alliance is just basically killing it today. This is like... This is insane, the amount of freaking like, domination Alliance has pretty much done today. And that makes four AFKers. Surprised the warrior doesn't want to help out his teammate, huh? Yeah, I think we're we should just probably go for a three cap at this point. I don't think the rogue has the <laughs> the rogue's not gonna go for it. He's just not. There's the land hands I was telling you about.
trapping. Faint death. Give my health back with exhilaration. Oh, this this guy is so undergeared. Holy freaking 21k. All the horde are undergeared today, and then Alliance is like every battleground I've had has had a gladiator on an alliance side as well. It's actually insane. I think there's one this background too, I don't remember who it was. Uh, let's get some of my health back. Just need one person on this burst. I feel so bad for this droid. When it's this late into the first patch of the expansion, like, it's just... I feel like gearing it all this hell. If you didn't catch up with the start, it's miserable. Arenas are full of boosters right now, rated battle guns are slightly getting to that point. It's just like, it's miserable. I don't think any expansion has been this bad. Get out of bear form, even though it's not gonna matter. And there, ladies and gentlemen, is the three cap. I don't know, let me know in the comment section down below what you guys are experiencing in battlegrounds these days. Like, uh, let me know your faction, let me know how your backgrounds are, do you think Horde is winning more, do you see Alliance winning more, uh, I don't know, I'm just curious on people's different outcomes. For me, it's been Alliance, but I know a lot of people are still saying Horde is winning, so it just depends, I guess, on the person. I feel so bad for that druid. If you're extremely undergeared, just do the Covenant quest chain, save yourself the time. It, it takes like a freaking month just to get a full 197 PvP set when you could just get it in like 3 days with the Covenant quest chain. It, it's pointless otherwise. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video, and um, I will catch you guys. For the next one. Peace.